Hey everybody, welcome back. David Dion and the absolutely bubbly Miss Lady Pop Hunter here with another weekly roundup taking a look at what is coming soon to the adult collector's market in the form of pre-orders and so on and so forth. Hopefully, hopefully they won't get canceled. You never, <laughs> never know. You never know. You never know. But there's plenty to look at, a little more than last time. Last time was pretty slow. End of the year, you know how it is. But we'll go ahead and we'll get started. We're going to get started with... Bandai Spirits, and that is the No Way Home Spider-Man black suit. No Way Home Spider-Man. And this is $85. Hmm. $85. I haven't heard very good things about uh, about some of the Bandai Spirits figures. Oh, you haven't? No, I have not. I haven't, I haven't handled any, hmm. but I've been hearing that there's been problems. I'm hmm. just curious. If anybody has anything to say about that. But it's not meant for you to play with and take outside and play with your friends. Yeah, I know. But, you know, people pose with them and I guess they've had problems. Mm. At least this one does come with a stand, although they don't show it. But that does get to be a problem. Mm. Now, this is from D20. D20 Studios. I've shown them before. They're like wolves. 112 scale wolves, to be exact. Or large enough that a 12th scale figure can ride them because he's about seven and a half inches long oh, wow. and it's an articulated werewolf werewolf and this is 140 dollars yeah if you if you got a figure that mm -hmm. ties in with a wolf then i guess that would be cool or if you wanted to just have a 12 scale figure ride one and there are upgrades oh, okay because oh, okay. this one comes with all that armor and the big saddle so that, you, I don't know, you can put your Mezco Batman on him or something. Mm -hmm. This is 200 The other one's 140 This is 200 And there's another upgrade mm -hmm. with more pieces. And you see there's a standard there with the upper torso of a skeleton and some other weirdness. 250 for that. Mm -hmm. 250 for that version. There's something different for 112 scale collectors there. Yeah. Dark Side Collectibles. Dark Side Collectibles has a one third scale Captain Kirk. Is that that guy? William Shatner. Yeah. 60s William Shatner. Oh, he 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 looks different. Yeah. Well, I mean, and this That's is not a good likeness. It's polystone. You know, it's hard to get his likeness right. Mm. It really is. I, I've I've heard that argument a lot about statues and figures of him. I don't know what it is, but it's hard for them to really kind of nail it. This is a third scale. $1,205. Because at first I thought it was the new one with that young boy. Oh, yeah. I mean, it don't really look like him either, but that doesn't <laughs> look like William Shatner, William Shatner at all. I don't know. It, it's hard. It's hard to nail the likeness. I don't know what it is about, mm -hmm. about Maybe Shatner's face. Maybe he got that face. kind of face. Yeah, he's just got a weird face. Mm -hmm. How about some Funko? Didn't get any Funko last week. I know some of you are just like itching for some Funko. Not me. Oh, okay, well, starting off, Batman, because you know that film is coming out. The Batman movie. There's some. I actually want to see it. I just mm -hmm. want to see if it's going to be any good. Yeah, hopefully, I mean, if it, if it. they tell the story dark enough, it'll be okay. But in all fairness, they haven't gotten Catwoman right since Michelle Pfeiffer, and then only barely. Well, she was horrible, you know? and uh, that guy is real dark. I've seen some of his movies, and he can really be depressed on you. Yeah. You know. And that fits with Bruce Wayne, Wayne's uh, mood swings. Although he's supposed to act like the goofball socialite yeah. in, in person, but behind the scenes he's miserable. Yeah. But two uh, pop rides and some chains there, a jumbo sized pop, Batman. I wonder if he bulked up because he's a skinny guy. Yeah, uh, he would have to. I would think it, it would only make sense. And he, you know, he's wearing that mm -hmm. suit, so. Yeah, who knows? still. More Batman exclusives, mm. Pops, Hot Topic, Funko Shop, Target, Pop in a Box, Walmart 4-Pack. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. I know it does kind of put me off that 
Catwoman is in it. I, I don't like seeing Catwoman in these movies. No. The only Catwoman I ever liked was in the 66 Batman. Eartha Kitt. Eartha Kitt and the other one. Both, uh, they, uh, uh, both of them did a great job. Mm. I forget the name of the first woman. She just seems annoying. Even in the cartoon, she's annoying. You know where she really sucked was in Gotham. I want to reach through the screen and choke her to death. Oh, that's when they were kids. Yeah, man, she was annoying. <clears throat> yeah. But, um, yeah. More Batman, a chase of... I, who is that that's supposed to be? Butler, Alfred? Isn't that? Yeah, I Alfred. I guess so. I don't know. And uh, chase a cat woman and what have you. And plush. Oh, boy. That looks terrible. Yeah. <laughs> that just looks really bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> Disney? Disney Walt Disney World 50th anniversary. Oh, those are diamond. Diamond okay. collected, yeah, diamond collection, hot topic, and box lunch, and mm. regular keychains. For your keychain wall. Oh my God. I want to see the person with that keychain one. Somebody has one. I know. Oh. People mover. That's the I ride. guess those link together. Mm hmm. Like all the other stuff they got that links together. Yeah. And then uh, Captain Hook and Mickey, Sorcerer's I to get Apprentice that Cap. Fantasia. I never seen Fantasia. Really? Mm, I, I'm have, a I have it. Oh, you got it on um, Yeah, I got it on disc. Yeah, Fantasia. Oh, wow. Okay. I didn't it's, know it. It's fun. I've actually. heard it was really good. Yeah. Space Mountain, a uh, little Mickey astronaut there. Mm -hmm. A dog. Who's the dog? I, I, I can't remember. I've seen that dog yeah. around. But it's flocked. Yeah. And then another Mickey Hot Topic exclusive diamond collection because they put some glitter on his head. Yeah, and his little hat. Yeah, his little vest. And some plushies. Of, oh, I don't, you know the Epcot Center. Yeah. <laughs> you don't hear about Epcot. Is that still even open? I don't know. You don't hear about it. You hear about Universal Studios yeah. and the zoo. Or the safari or whatever. I've never been to Disney World, so I don't know. I've been to Disney World twice. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> don't be a hater. <laughs> I don't care. Yeah, you can't go now. No, I can't go now. I don't want to go now. I'm too old for it. <laughs> Anyways, too old. It's just that Disney is The too magic of Disney gone. that we grew up with is gone. Long is, gone. Mm-hmm. And so is Funko. And now we're taking a look at Hot Toys. Yeah. And Hot Toys with their quarter scale Iron Man Mark IV. One quarter scale. It does light up. No die cast. It is all plastic. plastic. All plastic. How much is a quarter scale of plastic Iron Man worth? $610. I'd rather fork off the extra money for die cast. Yeah, well, and there is an attachment to this that you may buy separately, and that oh, is the little. suit up gantry quarter scale to go with that figure if you want it for an additional $485. $400? $485 for this gantry. What if you just want the gantry? You can buy just the gantry, it's being sold separately. Oh, okay. However, since you brought it up, mm -hmm. there is also a package deal. Where you can get the Iron Man and the Gantry for a thousand and fifty-five. How much is that? I don't know. What you say, six ten plus four eighty-five? So yeah, you save forty bucks. Oh okay. I think yeah, you'll save forty dollars. Around about there. Yeah. Forty whole dollars. Thank you. That forty dollars adds up. Oh, does it? <laughs> yeah. Mattel, more of their He-Man and the Masters of the Universe, like kitty new cartoon. kitty cartoon, which is evidently more popular than the Revelations. That's what um I've heard. Yeah, I'm hearing that uh, adults are enjoying watching that better than they did the Revelations. Yeah, because because is is Tila's not in it. Oh, is that what it is? I haven't seen either of them, so I, I can't I, I can't personally it. judge. No. But this is Man at Arms with his cycle for twenty five coming out here. Oh, that's Man at Arms. Doofy looking figures. Yeah, um, they do look kind of. And everybody's strange. got bikes, so like Battle Cat bike. Um, who is it? Panther is is a motorcycle. You're like okay, 
I mean, even Orko is a freaking robot because it's in the future. Mm. There's also Trapjaw, <laughs> and he gets a, a cycle. Trapjaw looks ridiculous. Yeah, the teeth. They're, <laughs> they're um, I don't know the physical style of this. I'm not feeling. It's it looks like it's for a kid, like a little yeah, I two three year old to play with that. Yeah. You buy that for your little kid to start them off. Yeah, you know, playing with toys and collecting. But, yeah. yeah, you know that most of the people buying this are our age. You think so? <laughs> I know, I know so. No. <laughs> Anyways, um, we'll jump off into McFarlane Toys. Mm -mm. Got DC cornered here. Multiverse Batwoman unmasked. Like you want to see her unmasked? Well, who knows? Twenty dollar range. I hear a lot of complaints about McFarlane Toys and action figures too. Come to think of it. I think uh -huh. I mentioned that before, because mm -hmm. they uh they they like NECA, they fall apart on you if you're not careful. Mm. Ink, I N Q U E Ink as Batman Beyond. Blight, Meltdown variant. Looks a little like Cosmic Ghost Rider. Bruce Wayne from the movie, the upcoming film. He looks big in that box. It's the uh, jacket, mm. the molded jacket, the sculpted jacket. Still 20 bucks. Mm -hmm. His motorcycle, however, is 33. So you pay for the motorcycle. That looks pretty cool. And you can see the motorcycle comes with the helmet. You don't get the helmet with the figure. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta buy, buy it separately. Thanks, McFarlane. And some more Mortal Kombat is Kotal Khan. These, are, of course, are also 20, and you'll find them anywhere. Kotal Khan and the Joker. Why is the Joker in Mortal Kombat? Because everybody's in Mortal Kombat. Mm -hmm. Terminator's in Mortal Kombat. They, any, any franchise they can squeeze in there. Oh, really? Make a few bucks, yeah. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Mezco, more Living Dead dolls. Of course, these are ten, <coughs> ten inches tall, and that is Pennywise. Pennywise Living Dead doll, fifty bucks. Neca, anyone? Hmm. Neca has this deluxe or ultimate foot soldier with a Mouser multi pack. However, the foot soldier pack on the top and the mouser multi-pack on the bottom are sold separately mm. are sold you said separately. ultimate pack is that bigger than a seven inch no because you get all those extra accessories oh, okay. it's still the same oh, basic size, size. Oh, okay. yeah but that's what you get mm. and also from NECA oh, boy. the Willie Nelson Chia Pet. He's still making Chia you, Pets. Well, you remember uh, NECA owns Chia Pet. You know, a lot of people aren't aware of that. Oh, they haven't, yeah, they haven't that. made any uh, they haven't made anything new recently. I guess it's officially promoted by Willie Nelson official there. <laughs> I remember when that used to, the commercial Ch -ch -ch -chia. Chia Chia. Yeah, that's right. Chia Pet. But it was an actual it. animal. Well, you know, the, yeah. it was an animal figure. Now yeah. they do all these faces Celebrities, yeah. I wonder if you send them a picture of you if they'll do your picture. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. yeah a personalized mm -hmm. Chia Pet. Then uh, you can give it away for Christmas. I don't know about that. And, of course, the uh, they got the classic headband on there. There's a lot, big significance to the headband. Yeah. I think I mentioned that before. I saw him, saw him in concert, and he changes the headband out, like, after every song. <laughs> and then he throws the, he the headband into the audience. Mm. I never caught one. You never been to his concert. I have. Mm. I told that's where I saw him doing it. You <laughs> saw it on TV. I didn't see it on TV. I saw it in in uh, the Topeka Expo Center. That's where I saw him. <sighs> premium DNA. And I've shown premium premium DNA before. They did like the Mad Balls action figures and stuff recently. They're doing Battle Toads. And uh, starting off here with General Slaughter. General Slaughter, who comes with a big price tag at $150 wow. for the action figure. Although General Slaughter is 15 inches tall. Okay, that's big. Oh, they, 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 they don't show, they don't have good 
pictures. I like to be able to show accessories and things like that, but they don't have a lot to show at the moment. But, you know, we'll just go through this. That's General Vermin for 100. General Vermin is 12 inches tall. So for 3 inches, you get to pay an extra $50. Is that how that works? Because there's more plastic being uh, used. Oh, gee, I guess so. Oh, and here's... Uh, These are in the six inch range, and that's Porca Pig. <laughs> Porca Pig, 45 mm. for Porca. Rash. It looks like that Ninja Turtle, uh, I can't remember which one, but it looks like one yeah. of the Ninja Turtles. Kind of the same concept. Yeah. Rash is 60. Oh, the price is going down. The prices are all over the place. Rat Bones is 45. Wow, they are all over the place. That's what I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> Rat Bones comes with some shields. And there's Zitz, who is 60 again. <laughs> if anybody's interested in that. Sideshow. Mm -hmm. Dark Knight. So I'd show the Dark Knight with the Thunderbolt in the background there, holding him up. So it looks like he's uh, eating lightning and crapping thunder, I guess. <laughs> this Batman Dark Knight Returns, $670 for this piece. And it is not mixed media. It is a solid piece. Mm. There's your apple for scale. So he's about the equivalent of three Smurfs high. Square Enix? No, it's not. A, a, a apple, um, three apples are a Smurf. A Smurf is three apples high. Yeah. So tell me that's not at least nine apples in height, which means it would be oh, three okay, Smurfs. Oh, I see what you're saying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you got to be quicker than that. Yeah. Square, a Square Enix, Dragon Quest Six, and that's Bring Arts Terry. Bring Arts Terry. One twelfth scale action figure for ninety five. Hmm. Looks like a faceplate change up yeah. instead of a head. I don't know because it's not in English, so I can't I can't read that part. And then Super Seven, which has a lot to talk about this week. Mm -hmm. They got another wave of their Simpsons figures, which I think Playmates made the original wave of uh, Simpson figures, I believe. Oh, did they? Yeah. That's Bartman. Because he's a uh, dog eating the homework. Hmm. Santa's little helper. Yeah, Santa's little helper. And these are, of course, $55, the Ultimates range. is yeah. typically $55. Unless otherwise specified, Duff Man. I don't remember him. <laughs> you don't remember Duff Man? I didn't see The Simpsons <laughs> that much. I probably seen ten episodes. I mean, I never, I never disliked the show. I just mm -hmm. didn't watch it. I, the episodes I seen, I liked, but yeah. I, I just didn't watch I'm it. Add it to our uh, lineup someday. Mm -hmm. Probably all the way up until Disney bought it is fine. Hank Scorpio, which I think is a really interesting choice. You see, he's got a flamethrower, world's best boss. He was like the evil super villain, like trying to take over the world, like James Bond type villain on the show. Mm -hmm. And Homer ended up working for him at one point, but he actually was a really nice guy, except when he wasn't taking over the world. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I just think it's an interesting choice. I like how Super 7 picks oddballs every once in a while yeah. and Krusty the Clown with his uh, cigarette smoking monkey there and we have some more reaction figures there is Jamie Summers as the bionic woman and of course also <coughs> Fembot and they could have given you a different image for the Fembot they couldn't have put a picture of the Fembot instead of just Jamie Summers on a generic card for both of them. I'm surprised they did that. They weren't thinking of it. Well, they should have. I thought of it. Johnny Cash. 
<laughs> I like Johnny Cash. <coughs> yeah, I like Johnny Cash, too. You know who else liked Johnny Cash? Who? Columbo. Yeah. yeah he was the, on an episode. He was on an episode of Columbo, and Columbo actually liked... Oh, there's, a, there's a couple of people that Col you could tell Columbo liked him. Mm-hmm. And Descendants, cool to be you figure. I have no idea who that is. Me neither. I don't know what that is. Somebody can tell us in the comment section. These are all 18 bucks standard. And for some reason, Mutagen Man is out again. And this was an Entertainment Earth exclusive, glows in the dark, it's like 70 bucks. Mm -hmm. And now it's on Big Bad Toy Store without the Entertainment Earth sticker. Yeah. But it's the same figure. And I don't get that. I missed something. I missed the memo. Yeah. And Valiverse, another wave, a new wave from Valiverse. We talked to that guy briefly at one of the shows. Joe Fest, I believe. Yeah, we talked to him uh, a little bit. Yeah, we had did a little, little mock interview, I guess. We yeah, it was only like five on minutes. Video. Yeah, mm -hmm. just real quick. Him and the uh, and the other guy with the Ape Verse figures. Mm -hmm. But this is the Delta Gear Pack, so it's not the figure, just the gear. Oh, which you okay. see on the right side there. Mm -hmm. $15, so it's an accessory pack, and they're showing you That's a generic six scale? figure. No, it is 12 scale. So it's about the same, mm -hmm. the, the Valiverse figures are the same size, and actually, I believe, is a compatible, no, with the G.I. Joe Classifieds figures. Oh, because I was going to say that would go well with that Delta Force you showed last week. You remember with the the that figure was six scale though. Yeah, that's what yeah. I'm saying. If yeah. that was six scale, those would go well together. And here's your Delta Trooper figure only. Beachhead. Yeah, beachhead. But you get uh, <laughs> oh. two two heads, so you can army build with this. That's not two heads. That's yeah. an Asian and a black guy. Well, you get two heads, so you can swap his head out, and make him a different color. <laughs> and he's twenty four dollars. <laughs> How do you know he's Asian? Look at her eyes and how yellow the skin is. That could be a Caucasian. Yeah, sure. With a tan and some long eyes. You don't know. Mm-hmm. It could be. It ain't. $24. Duster. With and without uh, old oldie time 1800s mustache. Yeah, what is up with <laughs> I don't know. That's a beard, too, right? Yeah, he's oh, got, got a little... Neck. Thing. I think that's a beard. Mm -hmm. There's a little chin hair there. So <laughs> the clean shaven version <laughs> and the face version. Yeah, it comes with all that equipment. The and he, these are 32 for the regular figures, by the way. Mm -hmm. Garrison Calvary figure. <laughs> and I think they did the same thing again. They don't show it, but I believe he has two different uh, color palettes for the head. Mm-hmm. Night Ops from the Steel Brigade. So snake eyes. And this one I believe is a big bad toy store exclusive. Oh, okay. Yeah. Rollout. <laughs> Not roadblock, rollout. With and without Mask, so head swaps. Scarabs. Oh, they got a lot. That's a big wave. Yeah. And a an updated Sergeant Slaughter. His mouth looked like Popeye. That's how he really looks, though. Now that guy's all chin. You've met him. Yeah. We, we've met him. He, he's at like every show we go to. He is. <laughs> he gets around. He must live in the Atlanta <clears throat> area. He probably does. Because he's always there in his little, uh, that little chair you push around. What you That walker. Oh, he's not in a walker. You know the one where you got the wheels? He always sitting in it. Oh, you mean uh, like an office chair? <laughs> no. I don't think I don't know what you're talking. You sure you're talking about the same guy? <laughs> okay, but anyway, Sergeant mm -hmm. Slaughter gets around, yeah. and this is another figure, an updated figure of him, and then Trigger.
and a weapons, weapons pack, pack Charlie. And you get 17 pieces. Weapons pack Charlie. Weapons rack not included. Oh, that's what I was about to say. Yeah. Are you going to say that pegboard? No, you do not get the pegboard. Is that sold separately? I don't know. I have not seen them advertise a pegboard. I guess they're giving you an idea to do it yourself. Yeah, do it yourself pegboard. Yeah. I'm sure somebody sells a pegboard like that because there's a lot of that 12 scale sort of accessories and things and bits and pieces being sold nowadays. Yeah. But, you know, I'll throw it out there to you. You see anything that caught your eye this no. week? No. No sale. <laughs> where's it, where's that from? Nobody knows that. Oh, come on. No sale. Thought we could tempt you. You don't know where that's from? I know where it's she from. She knows where it's from. See if anybody get, can, can guess that. You can tell me in the comment section. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> it, is, it is from classic television. It is from classic television. Um, did I see anything that I would want to hurt my wallet for? You can get those Mickey Mouse Pops. No, that's all right. Oh. I do like the Vala Force, Force figures. Mm -hmm. Not Probably not going to get them. <laughs> uh, but I'm just saying I do like them mm -hmm. and I like what Super 7's doing with the Simpsons figures mm -hmm. but you know I haven't uh, I haven't jumped off on that either you know you can only jump down so many rabbit holes honestly mm -hmm. and then you're just broke <laughs> but uh, anyways I'll throw it out there hey guys did you see anything that you liked tell us about it in the comment section down below mm -hmm. please do give the video a thumbs up if you got something out of it share it if you can subscribe if you knew all that good stuff Check out some of our other videos. We do more than just a weekly roundup on this channel. We are all in nostalgia. While well, you can still get some. What are you looking for the cat? Yeah, she was right there. Was I didn't right want there. to roll the chair back and yeah, run over No kidding. The poor thing. Anyways, if that's it, then what more can I say? But thanks for watching, and we will see you again soon.